Hello everybody, welcome back. The objective of this session is to see how to change the price for multiple materials at one single go. Uh, so let's try looking at certain materials. Let us pick up some materials. So I have around three materials. So I have around three materials right now. R hyphen zero one zero one, then R hyphen zero one zero two, and then R W hyphen zero one zero one. So let's see what is the pricing right now. We have um, zero two material R hyphen zero one zero one. Okay, I just want to have the price. So let's go directly to accounting. Plant is BTPL. Let's enter. So you can see here the price is seventy eight point one two right now. All right. So R-0101 is 78.12. Okay. Now let's change the material. MM02. Then we have R0102. Let's see the accounting, the pricing for this particular material. So we have around 62 material. Okay. 62 rupees is the price for r0102 and let's last see rw-0102 rw-0102 sorry 0101 so we have the price of 15.80 all right so now i say that all of the prices they have to be increased by five percent or maybe ten percent now, whatever the scenario let's say for example if you'd like to change the pricing for all these materials at one single go how would you do that so let's assume that we would like to make the new price of r0101 as 85 and r-0102 as 70 and r01 rw-0101 to be as $20 let's see how to do that so the transaction code what you would be using is MR21 and now MR21 you will be giving your company code and your plant press enter then enter your materials at one single shot rw-0101 and press enter you can see that it has already picked up the pricing the current valuation and the new valuation also by default it has picked up the current valuation only so if you would like to change it so the price what we wanted to have here was 85 for r0101 70 and 24 rw0101 so 85 70 and 20 all right so we have made this changes and then we press enter and then we just save it okay so we have a number range issue here so it says that this particular object in btpl we does not have the number range interval of 48 okay no issues let's go in uh, fbn1 okay so we are going to stroke n fbn1 and then btpl is the company code intervals so we have 49 50 we do not have 48 so let's assume let's make one as 48 2018 and then i I make this copy, okay. Copy this, okay. I do not want it completely. Okay. So we want from here eight thousand. To three thousand. Okay. 
So we have uh, picked up a number range now and let's see if in case it works out. Okay. Stroke N, MR21. So let's go into again, MR21 material. Okay, we have picked up R01 and then R0102 and then we have picked up R010. Okay, now I'm going to make this as 85, this as 70, and this as 20. Okay, let's save it and let's see. Okay, the system is processing. So you can see here that it says price change document. It's posted. All right. So you can see here it says that under this document number, under this period, the price has been changed. This was an old price, this was a new price for these three materials. All right. And this is a currency and this is a value change. Now let's try and see the pricing in the material master accounting view. All right. So 0101. Now this should be 85. Right. So let's go inside and then see if you guess it's 85 or not. So you can see it is updated as 85 now right here the total value will also be changed based on this new valuation okay now similarly let's try checking for r0102 okay so here it says btpl and then here you can see it is 70 now okay and then r01 Sorry, RW0101. Let's see what is the price for this. Okay. Okay, so this is also 20. So here you can see that the total value and then the price, it's all changed at one single shot. So if you have hundreds of materials and you really want to change all of them, maybe it could be a business decision at times. Uh, could be any any scenario you know there could be it could be dependent on the business so if in case if any such scenario exists then in that case you can use this functionality thank you so much for watching this video have a great day and if in case you like this video please do subscribe to my channel thank you